So most important for any makeup routine is skincare. And I'm starting with Esper's Optimal Skin Pro Cleaner 3-in-1 Cleanser, Exfoliator and Mask. And I'm just purely using it as my cleanser. It's got little micro beads in it. Excuses, manky ass cold sores. I've had them for over a week now and they are a buzzkill because I can't even wear makeup properly in that area and I can't wear lipstick. So when you do a full face of makeup and you don't wear lipstick, it just looks a bit odd. And obviously they're just embarrassing and look yucky. <sighs> obviously it's not good to put makeup on them or near them because makeup can breed bacteria. And, yeah, it can actually just make them worse. This cleanser is lovely. Like, my skin just instantly feels moisturised and fed and smooth. Like, I could leave that on for 10 minutes and it's cast as a mask then. Because now it's cleansed with the cleansing properties in it. It's exfoliated because of the slight little beads in it. Or they're not really hard scrubbing beads. They do go soft really quick. Because otherwise it would be too much friction on your face every day. Um, <coughs> and then obviously, yeah, you could leave it on to really soak in for 10 minutes and be the mask. But I'm not going to do that because that's a quick cleanse. I'm now taking, just for quickness because it's near me, cleansing water. The main component in this is water. But there's been some bad press about this lately saying it's really bad for skin. But it doesn't seem to be bad on my skin. I've got a horrible spot there coming out. But yeah, sometimes I just use water or straight away with a toner. Because the main ingredient in a toner would be water anyway. So I'm trying to avoid rubbing my nasty ass cold sores. Because obviously I just don't want to spread it. Although I think it's past the spreading stage now. It's just at an horrible scabby sore stage. Oh, I can feel a spot coming here as well. What's going on with my horrible skin? Okay, so now I've done that, um, I should tone, yep, I've got some here, I look so tired, I'm hungover. So I'm just toning with Simple Soothing Facial Toner, like I said, the main compo component in toner, it should say aqua, ingredients water brackets aqua. So why should be pay, you be paying more than a couple of quid for basically a bottle of water and a few other bits? So I don't believe in expensive toners. Although there might be some revolutionary kind of product or toner out there that I don't know about. So if you know of any, please do tell me. Okay, I'm going to try and wipe the top lip. Okay, so I'm just going to let that settle a little bit. And then I'm going to moisturise. So I'm using Esper. Optimal Skin Pro Moisturiser works amazing with the cleanser and toner. I've also actually, <clears throat> I've actually got their eye cream, 24 hour cleansing eye moisturiser and their Optimal Skin Serum and I'm actually going to do this because I've been neglecting my skin so it needs that extra moisturiser. So I put two drops of the oil in my hands. And I'm going to rub it in. I should have avoided that spot. <sighs> rub it in before I do the actual cleanser. Don't forget the neck because the neck ages quicker than the face. Get a wrinkly neck, although with my tattoos, hopefully I'll get away with hiding those wrinkles. And then I'm going in with moisturizer so just you know don't need too much although I've got dry skin I do like to go in with a bit 
if you've got oily skin you might not want to do this as much and you might not want to do it in your oilier areas so again do the throat usually I would go over with my mouth but obviously I can't do that because of my horrendous face disgustingness so that's just soaking in lovely if you're really dry and you feel that you're still dry after the this stages you should go in with your moisturizer again I mean I'd, I'll probably look shinier than what I actually am it's probably reflecting off the lights um, but I feel nice and moisturized but not too oily and wet I actually focus on my nose because I've had a cold Obviously, it's all dry around my nose at the minute. <laughs> Ideally, I should go over my nose twice because that it has been a little bit dry and flaky just from rubbing my nose from the toilet tissue. And then, yeah, I'm going to do some eye cream. I've only just started to use eye cream. The woman who does my facials kind of sold it to me. I don't think I really need it. But 32 this year, I might as well start just in case I can prevent any extra damage going on with age <laughs> probably putting too much product on there so I'm just putting the remaining on my neck um, and just tap that in you don't want to actually press too hard around your eyes and drag your eyes you don't want to be dragging your eyes this way you want to kind of be just tapping them any dragging just will help um, probably the wrinkles and collagen along breakdown of collagen shall I say I'm just rambling now okay and then a final step which is like my ultimate go-to for a really good base foundation makeup is then going with like a spray this one is marine bright formula softening lotion spray from MAC so I'll have some of that that sounds good uh, it's quite known a lot of people do prep and prime um, and then there's loads of other brands out there that probably do something similar it's just I think prep and prime is more water based and I think this is more moisturising the ingredients are coming off well that's crap pack packaging it's not even really that old so so now my face is quite wet so in between this layer um, Ideally, just let that all settle in for five to ten minutes. Um, yeah, just leave your face alone now. Just let it soak in itself. Don't rub it in. Just don't do anything. This is where you could probably damp down your eyes um, and get an eye primer on or go make a cup of tea. Have a break for five minutes and then come back and do your makeup when it's all settled in. And so, face nice and glowing. Nice and pumped. Um... So yeah, so that's my skincare routine. Um, hopefully it might have helped some of you. Oh, that needs to get gone. It's horrendous. So yeah, I'm going to do my makeup now. I'll put that in another video.